All right, so it's your squirrely beekeeper I'm up here in a tree acting like a nut. <laughs> so there used to be some other operations going on here. So yeah, this is a little pallet I cut down and nailed to this tree. It's actually pretty easy. And it looks like, oh, we chased off a wasp, which I am none too sad about. All right, so we'll set that there for a moment. And what do I have in here? Stuff that ain't gonna attract bees, it looks like. So right away, that ain't happening. We're just gonna remove, yeah, we'll leave one. Leave two in there. It's another paper wasp nest. I'll leave those two in there. And then what I'm going to do? I'm going to run into the uh, that's roach poo poos or bug poo poos. Here's the old lemongrass bag. Put some critters in here. So yeah, I probably ain't gonna catch much, but what we'll do here, we'll just go ahead and reuse this bag right here. Yeah, splatter eggs. Moth egg, don't know. So yeah, I'm just gonna take this lemon grass oil. Hmm. I don't know how I'm going to prop the foam. Plummet it to the ground. Yeah, so. I have some lemongrass oil. And I'm just going to uh, crank the lid off that dude. And then I'm gonna open this little baggie just a little bit. And I'm just going to. Oops. That should be plenty. Like four drops in there now. Yeah. So that's my answer to time release there. Let's close it almost all the way up, but just leave that little bit open. I'm gonna drop that in there like so. Welcome to the city. Did I say suburban backyard bee security cam and more? Mmm, oh, my fingers smell awful pretty. So I'm gonna get some old frames from the barn here. Maybe we'll just go down and have a look at the junky barn. Tough, you know, be all gung ho all the time. So here's real Bill and uh, my lame attempt, okay? So, so I've got to get organizers, cables, feeds, power, USB hub, and it's. Eh, I'm gonna order one more USB camera. But yeah, we came in here after frames, so I'm kind of doing a mental inventory. Have I actually got any cruddy frames? I, oh yeah, I know I do. I got them up in that cooler right there, if nothing else. These are awesome. So somebody in the community was like ordering meat or seafood or something. And uh, frames fit in there really nice. So I've got like four of these stuff full of frames. I'm like... So ready to expand, it's crazy. So let's see. That's something. See, I believe what I did is anything that was funky, except for maybe this one. Oh, yeah, 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 there you go. 
There you go. Let's start. Just enough to where that lid just fell off that high. <laughs> just enough to attract them, but not really. Won't be too upset if it gets tore up. Yeah. I like that. Oh, the really funky, nasty ones. I've already, there's my spinner. Some components. And there's some wax. So there we go. Let's have a look at these. So yeah, hopefully just enough to... Achoo! Pardon me. Stirred up some dust. And see these, see how this comb is funky? Some of that from um, just the way they kept building it. And then also uh, beetle pressure. Where they're trying to build comb, the beetles are in there eating. So that's, if you got funky looking, weird, strange shaped cells, you probably have a beetle problem. And then that's wax moth damage there. So I'm going to put these up in that hive, because uh, Mr. Ed and Randy and them guys on YouTube uh, like to uh, put these old frames in there. So here's another cam I got coming out of the barn there. It's this cam, this cam, this cam, this is a good, pretty good cam, except tell you what I've, I've determined I'm not gonna spend any more money on cameras unless I mean I'm spending money on real cameras third hand there we go all right so I'm just gonna set that there for a minute and if you really don't care about these there we go get get there there's one there's two I'm an empty space for them to... I thought something fell. Oh, I had another frame up here. That frame fell. Okay, so baited with some lemongrass oil <laughs> and uh, some rotten frames, and then I'm just going to restrip that and get the plane. And so uh, back to your normally squirrely afternoon. So just some preliminary stuff, just putzing around. And uh, just hope everyone on the west side's safe.